likes to embarrass me every small thing must be hi guys welcome back to my youtube channel so today um today is saturday and i'm doing um a clean up i don't know what to say but i'm just cleaning up busola's room for most of you that don't know this is busola's room but i am always in this room and that's because i create content here and part of my things are here you know busola cannot finish your wardrobe now so some of my things are here and some of the household things are also here let's say the bed sheets and the rest so i'm just doing clean up arranging rearranging setting up and the rest so how are you guys doing you're welcome back to the channel if you're new on this channel my name is susan i am a nigerian youtuber based in lagos here and i vlog about my life as a mom and a wife but mostly as a mom yeah so if you're new on this channel as i said you're welcome guys hi so i just finished relaxing my hair myself let me sit down so that you guys can see me well with the light i just finished relaxing my hair myself oh god see black from my head i just finished doing that and i was tired of having the natural hair 
not because of anything but because i was really tired i thought i was going to use that time to get to know busola's hair which i did and trust me having a natural hair is not easy my hand is spinning me having a natural hair is not easy and what again what again what did i even notice yeah i was spending more time taking care of busola's hair than taking care of my hair like i didn't have showed you my hair when I, before i lose the hair you would have seen you would have thought that i was a house help in my own house because the hair was looking tattered like i can make my hair myself like I, to even go to the sun myself on a normal day was really stressful for me like to go to the salon to take care of the hair was a, a, a task that i wasn't ready to do so i sometimes i would just make my hair myself and the lines are not usually straight all those things but the hair was growing fine it was growing i mean i cut my hair in november and this is june the hair was growing fine if you check the lights i'm going to wash it and you guys will see the hair was growing fine what i was spending more time on busola's hair rather than take care of my hair what again and hey i wanted to talk about this natural hair salons why is it that they don't employ stylists that have natural hair because i don't understand why why someone with a relaxed hair will be taking care of someone's hair that is natural do you guys get and most of them like people are complaining that most of these natural hair salons their stylists are always complaining about their hair as in they are always encouraging the the customers to go and relax their hair like they are tired of the hair the hair is too hard it's too like it's too tough like why please employ people that have natural hair so they will understand your clients better if not your salon is just going down the drain i don't get i don't know if you get how can you employ people with relaxed hair or people that do not have hair like some people are on low cuts some people are on relaxed hair you're employing people like that to take care of people's hair that are natural how are you expecting these people to understand the pain those people go through i don't understand like for me i don't know if i can travel and live with solar with anybody I will take my child with me no matter where I'm going to because number one, her hair is a concern. Like the person that is going to, I'm going to leave her with, even if that person is a family member, would that person have that patience to take care of Busola? Say, would that person have the time to do that? Would that person, like all those things are uh, going through my head. And my elder sister has the same kind of hair that I have. Like we, just the both of us, just the both of us have long hair in my house. Like, you guys did not even see me when I had long hair. Oh, just the both of my hair was reaching here when I had hair. So we had long hairs in our house. Our kids, her first son, her son had, her daughter had, but she didn't have the time to take care of their hairs. And she was like, when she was working, she would take her kids to salons that they would make that they make the hair. That's the daughter, the guy, the boy cut his hair off, obviously. The daughter's hair. So the hairstylist wasn't patient with her hair. Like I daughter's hair was the way Busola's hair was. Like the same way Busola's hair was when she was born. That was the way her daughter's hair was when she was born. But this salon, oh my god, like they were stressing that daughter that they were stressing that girl's hair. They will make the front part so tight that even you, as you are looking at it, you're 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 gringing like you're scared for the child. And again, when the girl is crying, they will, they will, be, they will be insisting for her to make her sit down, sit down, sit down. And the thing is tight. Take your time. Like, easy. Take it easy. So these are the things that I just say, ah, see, if I'm going to travel and leave my child with anybody to take care of for a period of time, I'm going to cut her hair because what was the point? Except that person, I will just take my time to educate that person. You don't have to make it perfect. You can pack her hair and do it make it even leave it tacky as long as you can but do not stress that hair most of these people don't know that i'm talking too much i'm talking too much i'm talking too much so I'm calm down anyway i need to go and wash my hair right now the hair is already shining back then in Benin republic when i was in Benin republic they don't allow see they don't even have the time to wait for your hair to the relaxer to become oily before they wash your hair. See, they will massage your hair from the beginning <laughs> to the end, and your hair will be, will be relaxed. Like they will mass. They, after you will, um, applying the relaxer on the hair, I'm talking too fast. After applying the relaxer on the hair, 
they will now massage the hair comb the hair massage the hair comb the hair like that's what they will keep doing until your hair starts looking relaxed like this then they will wash it but in nigeria once they are done relaxing the hair and combing the hair they'll just tell you to go and sit down to wait until your hair starts itching you before they can con they can go back to your hair. you guys i'm not using my glasses my eyes are to me it's looking red but it's okay but right now man okay let me go and watch the hair i'm talking too much ah i'm going to be giving this my mic a one a last the last chance but anyway you guys why is this camera is it because my backlight is not is this okay anyway you guys i just finished relaxing my hair <laughs> god i'm happy i did that because i was tired of the natural hair no life for you it's like i'm tired of everything i'm just i get tired of things easily Thank God I have the ability to change. But anyway, you guys, today is Saturday. I don't know if I mentioned it. Today is Saturday and after everything, I need to warm this bitter leaf soup that I made. I don't know why. Why is it that every time I make soup, they get spoiled easily? Is it because I don't put them in the freezer immediately? Because sometimes after making it, then the next, the following day, you will eat it. But later that evening, the thing will just get bad. I don't know why, but this one I savaged it because after I make I made it, the following morning I now dished out this part and kept inside the freezer. The remaining one that I was supposed to eat at least for myself and Busola, at least for a day and a half, got bad. We ended up stooling. And my husband does not eat anything aside from the normal vegetable soup, a widu soup, and a goosey soup. That man is just so local. Anyway, um, why am I looking odd? Is it the camera? Is it because my face is new to this for the first time? Or is it because my hair is too sleek? Making me look odd. But anyway, I want to I want to warm this soup. I want to warm the soup. I'm already Toying it over there, and I really love the soup. Like I really love it. I really loved it. And the fact that I've taken too much, too much sugar this period, I just decided to do something different. This is a soup. I want to microwave this now. Oh, okay. like my hair. Yeah. Don't touch, don't touch, don't touch. You touched it the last time and the thing stopped working. Okay, mommy. Hmm. I'm going to see clothes. Yeah. I'm coming. Let me fix it. Mom, itchy. It's itchy. What's itchy? Itchy. Mosquito. <laughs> this girl just likes to embarrass me. Every small thing, mosquito, mosquito. What is it? <laughs> Solar cover your mouth. Don't do that. Don't do that. Why is your body? Leave this mic alone now. Uh -huh. Mommy. Can you imagine this mic? You didn't connect this kitchen. Oh my god. Oh my god. Mommy. Oh. Oh. Mommy. Yes, my love. Yes, what do you want to see? Can you imagine this electrician man that came to fix this thing just disconnected everything in my house, made everything look odd. Like, oh my god! Oh, I have to take this thing over to mommy. Sola, I like Sola. Is that not your name? Mm -mm. Your name is not Sola again. What's that? Watermelon. Where is yeah. watermelon? Yeah. In the freezer. Hold on. Your body is wet. Take this thing off. <laughs> what? <laughs> and let me take it off now.
Pour the water all over your body. Take it off. Let me see. <laughs> no, 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 it cheats. Wait, let me give you your medicine. No, it cheats. So that's body is so prone to. You have to be careful with everything Busola Busola wears, everything Busola touches. <laughs> It's okay, it's okay, it's okay, it's okay. Let me give it this thing. So it will stop itching you, okay? It's cookie that will, that will stop it from itching you. This one has no thing, you say. Oh my God. Don't eat it now. I'll give you cookie. There you go. Finish it now. Oh, look. oh my goodness. Sola is such a good girl. <laughs> superhero. Sola is a superhero. So, so strong. Sola is so strong. Your medicine has finished. I have to get another one. Okay. Ah, God, do why this man doing this to me? Okay, let me take this. Okay. It's gonna let me call my husband. sleeping she has had a bath i want to arrange her things for school and i was just ironing and said let me just vlog this since i'm vlogging about my life you know anyway Bisola is sleeping everywhere is a bit of a mess after i've arranged the place but i want to quickly iron and arrange her things so let me show you guys so that's the solar sleeping like i had to like i had to carry on my back before she sleeps madam she does not like to sleep so monday we are going swimming tomorrow um monday and i already i like to pack her swimsuit in her bag every sunday because they swim sometimes once a week sometimes twice a week and that time that twice a week is when they did not swim the previous week they'll just do makeup classes so i'll be packing her swimsuit her glasses and her cap packing them then this one is just clothes that she they use i i always put in her bag just in case they she bedwets but so has not has not bedwetted on her body for over a year plus i just keep that there because she's still a child and anything can happen so a uniform i was iron i was ironing this ones this one is ceremonial uniform that they wear on special days and this one's uh this one is just her uniform they have two uniforms and one gown two shirts and one gown so i'm going to be arranging this ironing this and arranging that into this bag okay. that's it though. 